Hey guys and welcome to Aussie Reviews. Today I'm checking out the Blue Eddy PV350 solar panel. Now this naturally is a 350 watt solar panel. It's designed to work with various Blue Eddy portable power stations. Now you can see the details on their website for the different models. So the one that I'll be using today is the AC240 and that is one that I've reviewed individually so if you want to check that out guys um, have a look on my channel and uh, you'll be able to find it from there. So fold it up, what's the dimensions uh, on this? We've got 35.6 uh, inches or 90.5 centimetres by 24.1 inches or 61.3 centimetres and it's roughly about 2.5 inches or 6.5 centimetres uh, thick folded up. It weighs 30.6 pounds or 13.9 kilos. So we've got an external pocket where naturally we have the uh, cable to connect it to the actual Blue Eddy. We've got some um, straps here just holding it in place and we've got some padded carry handles. So the legs easily just kick out and are held in with a strap there so you can easily set it up for the correct angle for the sun. So size wise when it's unfolded is 35.6 inches or 90.5 centimetres by 94.4 inches or 240 centimetres. So it is splash proof and also the operating temperature is between minus 10 and plus 65 degrees Celsius or that's uh, 14 to 149 degrees Fahrenheit. So pretty much, you know, it'll handle most weather conditions in that regard. It comes with a standard MC4 connector and there's a 3 meter cable to plug it into your Blue Eddy. And at the time of doing this review, the current price here in Australia is $1,399. However, currently, once again, at the time of doing this review, it's on sale for $1,099. So it comes with a 12-month warranty and made in China. So at the moment in the AC240, we've got roughly about 300 watts of power coming in constantly. Now keep in mind too, guys, uh, you know, currently it's 2 o'clock in the afternoon here, so... Um, you know, and we are in the winter time, but hey, I'm still happy with that. 300 watts of power going in and topping up the Blue Eddy just nicely. So I always talk about having a good power source as a backup in the event of a blackout. So I've got my 500 litre upright fridge freezer plugged in. And we're running a 65 inch Sony LED TV. So as you can see there, we're using roughly about 330 watts of power to run the TV and the upright fridge freezer at the same time. We've also got roughly about uh, 295 watts of power coming in from the panels presently. So really you'd have a great run time as you can see there is 47 hours and we're only at 66% uh, battery. So obviously you're not going to have the sun of a night time and it's going to go down through the day. So this is just an example of what you could expect if you're going to use a 350 watt solar panel to offset your energy costs in the event of a blackout and using a Blue Eddy device. So I hope you've enjoyed, um, you know, just a demonstration, guys. We'll leave the review of that, so we'll catch you on the next one. 